Hey there, my name is Ni Hamoda. By the end of this video, you will be able to create this flyer, the one you can see on my screen. I'm going to show you step by step on how you can create this flyer with your smartphone. Without further ado, let's jump right into the video. Are you excited? All right, so the tool we'll be using is called Pixel Lab. All right, so if you are new to this this application called Pixel Lab, it's a design application. You can use it to create awesome designs, just like the one you can see on your screen. And I have a very short video, about twenty minutes or so, that will teach you like the interface just introduction to pixel lab i will drop the link in the description all right so let's jump right into this video so this is the flyer all right i'm going to remove it right now i'm removing it that is i'm deleting it all right so this is the background but i want it to be plain that is i'm going to take it plain white so that we start from afresh all right so let me put this guy here so what I want to do now is to click here just take note of where I'm going to click right now I'm going to click here are you seeing it here that is the place I'm clicking after I click there I will move here and I will click where I have color all right so that's what I'm doing now so I click here and click color so I click the color then we're going to head over to gradient all right now I have a gradient I'm going to be using for this design here. So this is the gradient. So go to gradient, then click on this button here. This plus. That is, you want to add a gradient now. So click on plus. So I'm clicking on plus right now. Then you will see that there are different options here. The option I'm going to choose is this option right here. This one. All right then i'm going to go over here now so i'm going to click on the option i've clicked on it now now i will touch this guy that is this one here this one i'll touch it just touch it then click on this bucket here all right then click on this guy here all right then select this color this one this one all right okay then move this here like this then move this here so that it's going to be like this so i'll pick one of the color i'll click on this one now this one here click on it click on the pocket again click on this guy then click on this click on this one here the middle one right so this is what i have so i can just maybe push it like this so that this is going to be the result So the next thing we want to do now is to bring in the image. So this is the image, right? This is the image we are going to be using for the design. So I'm just going to stretch it out like this. Alright. Okay. Okay. So we're going to bring in the uh, logo. So this is the logo, right? So I can remove this guy now, this one. I can just bring it somewhere here so let's put it somewhere here as a guide okay so bring the logo here all right then we can still reduce this guy small again like this all right so see what i'm going to do now i want to create um i want to create a, a, a gradient i'll click here click here i'll just put 12 and 12 by 12 Okay, so I'll move this guy to where we have this line here. You see that there? So now I'm going to create shapes. Shapes. Before that, let's write here the text, the main text. So let's go and get the text. So just write here every man's favorite. Vita, Vita, right? So this is it, right? 
right so click here so we're going to go and get a font the font we're going to be using is let's use all right let's use this font look at the name of the font Argen Tumsan Black I'm going to set it in the description so you can download it in the description so ensure you watch the video to the end so that you don't miss anything because to download the resources used you'll be able to you should be able to get the password in the video so i'll do this all right so i don't really like this font so i want to change font let's change it to this guy let's go to line space and close up the space like this then increase it more all right all right let's push this one up then need to increase it okay all right so let's still move this one here Remember this your line to so ensure that your test is not going out. Alright, so that is that. So let's get a shape. So we just come over here, click on this, click on shapes, then rotate this, bring this here, bring this here, bring this here, like this, then bring this here like this. Then the, the radius, just bring it maybe towards 11. Okay, then we can go to color now. Color right here. Then you see why I went to now this place here. Go to color. Then enable the color. Then click this plus. Then click this guy here. Then select this color. Right. So I've selected that color now. So I'm going to duplicate. That is, I'll duplicate like this. I'll put it there. Duplicate again. I'll put it there. Another one there. So we ensure that the bosses, these shapes are not crossing the line. Are you seeing that now? All right. So we're going to get text inside those shapes. So I'm going to click here plus get the text. All right. So the text that will be here. All right. So this is the text that will be there. Put it there like this. Come here. Just make it bold. Right, so put it there. All right, okay. Then you copy, put this one here. So for this, we have pro. All right, so that's for that. Bring it here. Then you copy this, bring this guy here too. So for this is going to be magnetic, blah blah blah. So magnetism to maintain healthy motor. So this is it. We are done with just this part of it, all right? So um, the next thing we want to do is to bring in this guy here, where we're going to add the website. So let's let's write order now, order now. Then the website www dot um, neutrophy.ng.com okay so i'm just gonna come here i will uh, remove the board by clicking this i'll put it here all right so i'll come over here i'll click on background and i'll add a white background then i'm gonna go over here um change the color to black so so this color here is going to be black then this color here is going to be um, this dark green then let's go back to the background let's um, increase this to the to here 20 let's make it 30 then increase this to 30 also okay then let's increase the top padding Let's increase the bottom padding also. Alright, then we can come 
watch videos and just do this okay all right so let's reduce the little bit so remember to always ensure that this thing is properly placed so put it here all right so that is that so the next thing we want to do is to bring in um let's bring in let's add a little shadow to this guy Alright, so let it shadow be this and let it uh, be darker. Let it let it just fall down. So let let it just fall down. Okay, let it fall down. No, remember I said down. Okay. Then let's reduce this. Alright, so that's that. So what we want to do next is to bring in a background. So I'm gonna click here. In, in this background. That I'm going to use to add patterns to it's a pattern background, okay? This a pattern background. I'm going to go to erase color and I'll click this and I'll select this and pick the color that is this major color here, all right? Then I'm going to come over here, I'll go back to color now and I'll click this, then I'll come here, I'll click this. Right. Okay. Let's not even use that. Let's use um this color or oh, maybe black. No. Let's use this color. Then let's send it to the back. To the back. All right. Then let's reduce the opacity like this. All right. Reduce the opacity like this. So that's that so i want the man's face to be a little bit pronounced all right so to do that i'm just going to come over here let's remove this guy you can delete this one now you can come here now click on shapes just put the shapes around the man's face okay so let's just be green okay we can send it to the back like this send this guy that is this background to the back then i can bring this again copy it and just bring it here like this all right so with that you are done with the design you can see that it was quite easy so click here ensure that all these texts are aligned all right you can see them make sure that they are properly aligned all right okay you see everything properly aligned so thank you for watching to the end my name is Ni Abuda. please I want you to drop a comment, tell me what you learned from this video and of course check our WhatsApp group, this culture group and drop your own design. I will see you in the next tutorial. To get the resources used, ensure that you have watched the video from the beginning to the end and get the password to unlock the description. That is the link in the description. Don't forget to like this video, drop a comment, tell me where you are watching from and subscribe.